Hey y'all, we're back with another update. It is day 142 on the Free to Play Mr. Shard Only account. I didn't do an update yesterday because honestly not that much had really happened. Uh, we've just been sort of getting ready to do the new actual fusion, which we will try and do once the clan versus clan starts. Actually, I probably need to do a little bit more work to finish up the epics and the rares. Um, so, you know, we've got a two days basically to finish it and we'll probably get it done close to the end of that but we'll make sure it happens in the cvc uh in terms of progress we've got one of the epics to level 50 and fully ascended i, I should have waited to ascend him but i kind of forgot um so the other two are getting close to level 50 we will ascend them again once cvc starts in terms of the void epic i need this last rare to hit level 40 and then I will ascend him and do the fusion. I will do that once the CVC starts because we'll get an extra um, extra clan points for getting this unique uh, epic void epic that we haven't got before. So uh, if you haven't done that yet, definitely keep that in mind. Um, the other ones were definitely worth fusing during the champ chase, but this one we needed the rare from the champ chase before we could do it. So it's good to do it now and get the extra CVC points for it. So that's the plan for that. Um, in terms of other things we made progress on, I was farming campaign uh, to level up the champions because it was a good a good place to do it. We didn't need to spend our energy on anything else, and we have we do need to get this done within the next nine days. So I pushed up to 439 of the quests, and then depending on what we get for the daily, we'll have a few left over that we'll finish off on like the last day. But yeah, that's going pretty well. Um, let's check the altar of souls and see if there's anything in here we're interested in. Not really. No, let's skip that. Uh, other things that we have going on, we have this deck of fate events. This is for upgrading artifacts. Honestly, probably just going to skip this. Um, I think you get some from getting the artifacts. Yeah, so dungeon divers and upgrading them. I don't know. This event is like, it's kind of lame. I like events where I can like be strategic. And with this one, it's so RNG. And I don't know, the rewards are kind of lame anyway, so I'm not going to really worry about that too much. Do this champ training. Um, I did waffle back and forth on whether or not I want to try and get any top rewards from this. I'm leaning towards no right now, um, just because it would be kind of a struggle. And honestly, I just I kind of need a break after the uh, nude fusion. So I probably will just skip that. Um... The other thing we have going on is we have this spider turn attack. I am going to be farming spider from here on out to level up the champions for the fusion. So we might pick some of these rewards up along the way. We've got this um, prism shard thing going on right now in terms of... So the idea... I mean, I'm sure you all know this by now, but the idea is you get these prism shards and then you have a chance... Like, there's a limited pool of champions that you could summon with them. And all the shards get automatically summoned at the end of the event period, so in about a week from now. I'm not sure what I'm gonna do with these on this account. I already have 30, so we're gonna get at least one summon. And then we'll probably pick up some more from these events. So I don't know if I'm gonna use the champions we get from this or not, I haven't really decided. Um, but I don't know, let me know what you think and we'll see. I mean, odds are we get a bunch of crap anyway, but if it's a rare, we'll definitely use it. If it's not, then I don't know, we'll see. Honestly, are there any rares in here I even want? I already have a viewer, I have Master Butcher. I don't think I have Pathfinder Kate, actually. She might be useful. Um, let's see. Yeah, I don't know, those are the main ones. Oh, they have an Orn in here, Cornelia. Yeah, there's some good champs in here, but honestly, I don't know, it's whatever. Uh, so yeah, uh, that event's going on. I'm not really gonna try for it, but we might pick some stuff up along the way. Um, other things we have going on, let me make sure, yeah, Forge Pass making progress, we're on, uh, level 37 so far. Let's get our Sparring Pits. Oh, actually, let me set a timer for that. Um, the other thing we have going on is the Clan Quests are resetting tonight. Um, so in about seven hours from now, so I'll make sure I grab these. And do I need to spend any coins? No, we spent them all, all our Clan, clan Shop Gold. Um, so that's good. In terms of what we're doing today, we're just going to wait uh, until the Clan vs. Clan actually starts before we do any of our faction wars or any of that stuff, just to make sure we get the points for that while we're working on it. We won't claim any of our energy refills until after the event starts as well. 
Um, the only other thing I will work on is Doom Tower. Oh, I will say I did make some progress on secret rooms in the Doom Tower. I can't do all of them. There's a lot of ones in here, like, you know, like Sacred Order. It's like I have three champions, no healers, no revivers or anything. So, you know, most of these I can't do. But I did get a few of them done. Picked up a few fragments for, um, what's his name? Archmage Helmet. So, yeah, that'll be cool. Um, in terms of... Yeah, I think that's pretty much it. We're pretty much done with the Doom Tower for now. We're just farming it every day uh, for the Frostbite gear. But, yeah, we maxed this out a little while ago, and that's pretty much done. So that's that. Oh, uh, other thing I wanted to mention, um, Great Hall. We've got 2,400 medals to spend. So that's going to get me the max out resistance in uh, Magic. I will do that once CVC starts, because you do get CVC points for maxing that. Um so still making good progress in Live Arena, doing it every day. Uh, I haven't... I don't know. I don't know where I'm going to spend these next. Maybe Demon Lord. I honestly want to see what Newt does for Clan Boss. Because um, if he can get me close to a potential like 3 key or 4 key or I don't know. We'll see where we're at um, in terms of doing Ultra Nightmare Clan Boss once we get Newt. Because uh, I think he's going to be a big upgrade for the Clan Boss team. And then maybe we'll use area bonuses in the Clan Boss to help push us over the edge if... Um, if we're close to sort of breaking a key threshold, but we'll see how that goes. All right, anything else I want to talk about today? I think that's pretty much it. Yeah, yeah, I think that's it. All right, so um, I may or may not make a video tomorrow. I, maybe I will, because we'll have Clan vs. Clan stuff going on. Uh, we're kind of in a lull in between fusions right now, so I might not do uploads every single day. It just kind of depends on whether anything interesting is happening or not. Um, but, yeah, definitely take advantage of CVC tomorrow. And, I don't know, we'll see how far we get in terms of getting all the uh, rares and epics up to level 50. Might have to wait till the day after. Um, although, at the very least... Well, I guess, yeah, if I guess I want to summon Newt, I need to do it sometime in the reset after tomorrow. But it could be, like, two and a half days or day and a half from now, something like that. Um, so we'll see. We'll see. But, all right, I'm going to leave you there. I'll see you later. Cheers.